Hi, Scottish Cowboy here. Welcome back to the Scottish Cowboys YouTube channel. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to be looking at an accessory. A lot of people call these things accessories because the only necessity you need to play darts is three darts and the dartboard. But in my opinion this is a necessity. It finishes off a dartboard and it is the Pro Tour Surround from Target. Firstly, before we get into the review, I want to thank Target for sending me this. I recently reviewed Scotty Williams uh, darts and I had a unicorn surround and they've kindly sent me this so that when I'm doing my reviews I'll have a Target surround to match the Target darts and the Target board and the Target light, which I'll also be talking about in this video. So let's get a little look at the box, open it up and see what's inside it. So there's the Target Pro 2 box right there. We'll get it opened, take it out, nothing to see on the box really. Normal bit of packaging. Take it out. See what's inside the box, nothing else in there. So we... And that's it there, that's the Target Pro 2 surround. First impressions is, it's much thicker and sturdier than the one I've got on the board just now. You look at the back of it, and you can see how it's been moulded, press moulded. It's not your normal kind of foam, it's more like a hard material, but you can still press your fingers into it and flex it. So what I'll do is, I'll set the camera up, I'll take the one off I've got on just now, put the new one up, let it see it up, and give you a verdict. So that's the target Pro Tour surround fitted. One thing I will say with the target Aspar board. The target surround is very tight, it's snug. The unicorn one that I took off is quite loose on the target board, but it's something I would never have thought about. When I had this on my unicorn board, that unicorn surround was very tight, so there is a, a difference in the diameter of the boards. Not, not the actual size of the plane area, just the size of the actual diameter of the board. Getting the light to fit in, it's very tight as well, no play, no movement in it whatsoever. It just finishes it all off. And as I was saying earlier, I was going to talk a little bit about the Target Corona Vision light. A lot of people will ask me what light I would recommend, and I can only recommend this because it's the only one I've ever used. So I've got nothing to compare it to. But what I will say is, I've had this for over three years. It's still the original LEDs that's in it. And as you can see from how bright the board looked, it's not lost any of its brightness. It's still in perfect condition. It's a cracking light. I got that from Argos and I'm sure it was 70 quid, round about 70 quid, but it was a long time ago, so I can't really remember. I don't know what the retail at at the moment, but these are really, really, really good lights. I would recommend anybody buy one of these, try them if they're in the market for new light, try this. Weigh the mod surround. Now, the target mod surround, I'm sure, is less than £40. I will check that out and let you know exactly how much it costs. So, the, the, it's actually £40.95 for the Pro Tour surround. It's not the mod surround I was getting mixed up there. This is a Pro Tour surround. The mod surround is for the new mod that board rig, which I really want to get a shot and have a, have a try with that because it looks superb. But maybe one day I'll get that. Looking at my board now to what it was like, it's very aesthetically pleasing. The black target surround with the black light, the black edging on the board, it just, it's, it's just nicer. I'll still use the Unicorn one, don't get me wrong, but I'll be using the Target one with my Target board. I'll use the Unicorn one with my Unicorn board. But if I just show you this up here, the Unicorn one, very, very flexible, just a piece of foam inside it. I wouldn't be able to do that 
with the target one, it is so much more sturdy. It is flat, solid. If I do that with the unicorn one, you can tell it's just, it's just foam. That's all it is. So I'll get my wee bag just to go off this, get it on here. Use this for a long time while I'm using my target ass power board, which is still holding up really well. But if you're in the market for a surround or a light or a board, you can't go wrong with a setup here. So guys, thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day. Most importantly, keep enjoying your darts and I'll catch you on the next one.